And when a missing dog is reunited with their owners, and it's even better, when they return as a prize winner, you are not going to... Be- this story is great, OK? So Bonnie went missing last week in West Sussex, but luckily she was found by dog lover John Wilmer, who was on his way to a dog show, right? The rest is history. I'm going to fill you all in this all, all right now. And I'm delighted to say that here to tell us all about it are Bonnie's owners. Yes, are Bonnie's owners. Paula and Pete at Closier with Bonnie, who's waving at the camera right now. I absolutely love this show. Right, um, let's start with, well, with either of you, really. Shall we start with, shall we start with you, Paula? So, uh, so Bonnie went missing, right? What happened? Just talk me through it. Slipped out the back gate, which had been left open accidentally, and um, <laughs> went missing. Um, frantically searched the house for her, um, couldn't find her anywhere. Told the neighbours, both sides, both neighbours love her, so they were straight out there looking. Um, friends were looking, everyone was looking frantically because we were on a main road, um, couldn't find her. Uh, my husband went to the shop next door and says, anyone seen a dog? And the lady said, I saw one the other side of the road 15 minutes ago. So she'd crossed the main road and legged it up the road. And, uh, and yeah, so, you know, the rest is history. Are you going to tell, tell the story? Well, yeah. Um, Pete's turn. Myself, there was about nine of us, I think, out looking for her in total. Uh, I had a mate and his son come over uh, just to see me anyway, and I roped them into helping. And, yeah, about... Two and three quarter hours later, I rang my mate up because we'd gone in separate directions and the neighbours had, had sort of done what they could. And I said, look, you know, it's boiling hot. Just call, call it a day. And I'll find her. Don't worry. Um, and I rang my mate and I said, look, this is a, a fruitless search. She could literally be five foot the other side of a hedge and we wouldn't know. I'm, I'm just going to hope she comes home or someone's found her. And really, really. May, maybe on the Monday, because this was on the Sunday. Yeah, actually. but. Maybe on the Monday we'd, we'd, we'd find Ooh. her. But the really important thing here, and if people are watching this on telly, is that, is that Bonnie's currently wearing a rosette, isn't she? Yes. Now, now, Bonnie Very pr- left, left your house and, well, managed to find her way to a dog show and she came yes. third, didn't she? Yes. Oh, yeah. yes. I, I don't think she came third in the whole show, but she came third in the she rescue came, she category. She came third in the best rescue how category. Did, how, did she, how did she tell people that she was a rescue dog? This is nuts. How did she tell people? OK. <laughs> So this guy was on his way to the dog show with his dog, two beagles as well, and saw our little pooch running along the side of the road um, and thought, hang on, that's not right. And, you know, it was down a, a country lane, no houses or anything. Um, dog lover himself thought, oh, you know, I'm going to have to stop, even though he was late for this dog show. Stopped, ran around after her because she's a monkey and caught her, put her in his car, took a photo Um, put it on Facebook and then carried on because he was late uh, and got to the dog show, entered his dogs, I believe. And then, uh, and and then eventually we all sort of caught up via social media. I'd put a picture on the uh, Facebook and and he had, and someone had married them together and said, is this your dog? So he had a very quick chat. And I I think while he was there, he thought, well, well, you know, might as well enter her in as well. She's with me. (laughs) I've rescued her. I'll put her in for the rescue category. Entered her in. We, we didn't know this at the time. And uh, and she yeah she came third and we we had no idea until he he, he was on his way back later on uh, he said when we did chat he said oh, before he went to the show I'll bring her back later I'm on my way through about three o'clock ish handed her over to us uh, and said oh by the way this is her she won the rosette she said, so he told us to stop yeah. well <laughs> can I just say congratulations Bonnie and congratulations to to both of you <laughs> as well we do we do yeah. do a, a segment on the show coming up shortly called Dog of the Week where we try to reem oh, a rescue okay. dog. Um, obviously, Bonnie, Bonnie, Bonnie doesn't need a new home anymore, although it sounds like she might have nearly done it. She might have nearly done a little while ago. But can I just say thank you, both of you, both of you, for, uh, for, for being such good sports with this. And I think, no can problem. we have a quick round of applause for Bonnie, who I think she might have come third, but she's everyone's winner. Well done, Bonnie. Yeah, who's a good Who's a good girl? Who's a good girl? There we go. OK. All right. Thank you very much, everybody. Paula and Peter, close here. And, of course, the wonderful Bonnie. Hey, absolutely.